Did you know that global energy demand is expected to increase by 50% in the next 30 years? And that this could have a devastating impact on the environment and the global economy? But don't worry, we have good news. The future of sustainable energy lies in renewable energy innovations. Do you want to know what the five innovations are that will change the future of sustainable energy? Then keep watching. Welcome to Understanding Everything channel. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications to receive updates on our videos. And for those who have been following us, thank you for your support and please continue to share our videos with your friends. Today, we will be exploring the five key innovations in renewable energy and how they are shaping the future of sustainable energy. Let's get started. N squared 1, Solar Energy. Solar energy is revolutionizing the future of sustainable energy, offering a clean and renewable option that is being increasingly used around the world. Did you know that there are different types of solar energy and that new technologies are making it even more efficient? There are two main types of solar energy, photovoltaic solar energy and solar thermal energy. Photovoltaic solar energy. Photovoltaic solar energy is generated when sunlight hits solar cells, which are made of semiconductor materials. These cells absorb the sunlight and convert it into electricity. Solar systems can be installed in homes, businesses, and industries and can be used to power electrical equipment or to feed the electrical grid. The latest innovation in this area is perovskite solar cells which have the potential to increase efficiency and reduce the cost of solar panels. Solar Thermal Energy Solar thermal energy uses the power of the sun to heat a fluid, which can be used to heat water or generate steam, moving turbines and generating electricity. A promising innovation in this area is high-temperature solar collectors, which allow for large-scale solar thermal energy generation at high temperatures. Solar energy is an abundant source of energy available everywhere and is inexhaustible. With technological innovations, it is becoming increasingly efficient and accessible. By investing in solar energy, we are investing in a cleaner and greener future. Number 2. Wind Energy Wind energy is a clean and renewable source of energy that has gained attention in recent years due to its sustainability and potential to reduce dependence on fossil fuels. Wind energy is generated by the force of the wind, which is captured by wind turbines that rotate a generator to produce electricity. Wind turbines are composed of several parts, including blades, towers, and control systems. The blades are designed to maximize the energy of the wind, while the towers elevate the blades to heights where the winds are stronger and more constant. The control systems adjust the direction and speed of the turbines to optimize energy production. Wind energy is a renewable source of energy that is abundant and available in many parts of the world. Wind farms can be installed on land or at sea, known as offshore wind farms. Land-based wind farms are usually installed in open areas with constant winds, while offshore wind farms are located in coastal waters where winds are stronger and less affected by land obstacles. Wind farms can generate enough electricity to power thousands of homes and businesses, contributing to the diversification of the energy mix and the reduction of greenhouse gas emissions. An innovative example in the field of wind energy is the development of floating wind turbines which allow the installation of wind farms in deep waters where winds are stronger and more constant. These floating turbines are anchored to the seabed through cables and can be positioned in locations that would be impractical for fixed wind turbines. In addition, vertical wind turbine technology has also been explored as an alternative to traditional horizontal wind turbines, offering the possibility of lower visual and sound impact as well as greater efficiency in urban areas and turbulent winds. Wind energy is a sustainable and promising option in the panorama of renewable energy sources, with technological advances and innovations allowing greater efficiency and lower environmental impact. N-squared 3. Hydroelectric Power 
Hydroelectric power is a renewable energy source that harnesses the force of moving water to generate electricity. This form of energy is one of the oldest used by humanity, dating back over 2000 years ago when the first water wheels were used to grind grains and perform other mechanical tasks. Today, hydroelectric power is responsible for a significant portion of the world's electricity generation. Hydroelectric power plants work by harnessing the kinetic energy of water flowing through a dam or reservoir. The water is directed through pipes called penstocks, which direct the water to turbines. The turbines are powered by the force of the water, causing a generator connected to the turbines to produce electricity. There are several types of hydroelectric power plants, which can be classified based on their capacity, location, and method of power generation. Large-scale power plants, these plants are built on rivers with high flow and hydroelectric potential, usually using dams and reservoirs to store water. They are capable of generating large amounts of electricity, but also have significant environmental and social impacts, such as displacement of communities and alteration of ecosystems. Small Hydroelectric Plants SHPs, SHPs have a smaller capacity, usually between 1 and 30 megawatts, and are built on smaller rivers and streams. They have a smaller environmental and social impact and can be installed more quickly, but generate less electricity compared to large-scale plants. Micro and mini hydropower plants, these plants have even smaller capacities, ranging from a few kilowatts to up to 1 megawatt, and are suitable for providing energy to isolated communities and rural areas. They have minimal environmental and social impacts and can be installed relatively easily. An interesting innovation in the field of hydropower is the development of smaller and more efficient water turbines, such as horizontal and vertical axis turbines. These turbines can be installed in smaller rivers and streams without causing major environmental impacts and without the need for large dams or reservoirs. Hydropower is a clean and renewable source of energy that can provide electricity to cities, industries, and homes in a sustainable manner. However, it is important to balance the benefits of hydropower generation with the environmental and social impacts associated with this form of energy generation. N squared 4, Geothermal Energy Geothermal energy is a renewable energy source that harnesses the heat from the Earth's interior to produce electricity. This heat is generated from the radioactive decay of elements such as uranium, thorium, and potassium present in the Earth's mantle and crust. Geothermal energy is a clean and sustainable energy source, with low greenhouse gas emissions and reduced environmental impacts compared to other forms of energy generation. Geothermal power plants operate in various ways, depending on the type of geothermal resource available and local geological conditions. The main types of geothermal power plants include Dry steam power plants These plants use pure steam extracted from geothermal reservoirs to power turbines and electricity generators. They are the simplest and most direct form of geothermal energy generation. Flash steam power plants These plants harness the hot water and steam from geothermal reservoirs. The hot water is forced to expand into steam which powers the turbines and generators. The steam is then cooled and condensed back into water, which returns to the geothermal reservoir. Binary cycle power plants. In this type of plant, hot geothermal water is used to heat a working fluid with a lower boiling point, such as a hydrocarbon or ammonia. The vaporized working fluid drives the turbines and generators. This process allows for the utilization of low-temperature geothermal resources and reduces the risk of contamination of the geothermal reservoir. Geothermal power plants can be built in volcanic regions or areas with high seismic activity, where heat is more easily accessible. These regions include the Pacific Ring of Fire, the Mediterranean Basin, and the Rift Valley in East Africa. Geothermal energy is ideal for providing electricity to isolated communities or remote areas, as it is a constant and reliable source of energy, regardless of weather conditions or time of day. 
a promising innovation in the field of geothermal energy is advanced drilling technology, such as directional drilling and high-temperature, high-pressure drilling. These techniques allow for the accessing of deeper geothermal heat sources and previously inaccessible locations, expanding the potential of geothermal energy. In addition, research into geothermal enhancement technologies, such as hydraulic fracturing and acid injection, can increase the productivity and efficiency of existing geothermal power plants. Number 5. Bioenergy and Biofuels Bioenergy is a renewable energy source that is generated from organic materials such as agricultural waste, forestry waste, urban waste, and even energy crops such as corn and sugarcane. Biofuels, in turn, are produced from renewable raw materials such as vegetable oil, ethanol, and methane, and can be classified into distinct generations according to the raw material used and the production processes involved. First Generation Biofuels These are produced from food crops such as corn or sugarcane ethanol and palm or soybean biodiesel. These biofuels have several advantages, such as reducing greenhouse gas emissions compared to fossil fuels, but also face criticisms due to concerns about competition for resources between food and energy production. Second Generation Biofuels They are produced from non-food raw materials such as agricultural residues, forestry residues, and cellulose. Examples include cellulosic ethanol and biodiesel from microalgae. These biofuels have a lower impact on food security and land use compared to first-generation biofuels, and have the potential to further reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Third-generation biofuels, these are produced from genetically modified microorganisms, such as yeasts and bacteria, which are capable of converting raw materials into biofuels in a more efficient and sustainable way. These biofuels are in the research and development phase and may offer even more innovative solutions for renewable energy production. Bioenergy and biofuels have a fundamental role in transitioning towards a cleaner and more sustainable energy matrix. They can be used in various sectors such as transportation, electricity generation, and heating. Moreover, they contribute to reducing the dependence on fossil fuels such as oil and natural gas and to mitigating climate change as they capture and store carbon during the growth of the plants used in production. The development of advanced technologies and the encouragement of research and innovation are crucial to increase the efficiency, sustainability, and competitiveness of bioenergy and biofuels in the global energy market. The adoption of these renewable energy sources represents a significant opportunity to promote energy security, economic development, and environmental preservation. Like the video? Then please leave a like and share with your friends. The discussion about renewable energy is crucial for a more sustainable and green future. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Understanding Everything and turn on the notification bell to receive updates on our upcoming videos. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.